And her love made Clifford grow so big That the Howards had to leave their home Clifford's the best friend anyone could know He's the greatest dog ever I really think so Clifford's so loyal He's there when you call I love Clifford, the big red dog So they packed up a family car And the Howards left the city They moved to Birdwell Island and their many new friends There to greet Clifford and Emily Clifford's so much fun, he's a friend to us all I love Clifford, the big red dog Okay, guys, look out! Here comes my famous hop, hop, and slide! Go, T! Go you can it, do it, T! T. Hop, hop, and slide! Woohoo! T, 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 T! My turn! Here I come, T Bone! Hop, hop, and slide. Wow, slide amazing. Now you go, Cleo. Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, that's okay, Clifford. You can go next. Okay. Stand back, everybody. I'm gonna hop, hop, and slide. Ready? Here I come! Wahoo! Huh? Oops! Uh -oh. Maybe I'll just skip straight to the slide part. Good idea, big guy! Here I go! <laughs> that was great. Now you go, Cleo. Uh, okay. Sure, I'll go. Here I come. Whoa! Are you okay, Cleo? Yeah. Cleo, did you hurt yourself? Hurt myself? Gosh, I hope not. Then she couldn't skate with us anymore. Yeah, then I couldn't skate anymore. It didn't look like a bad fall. Um, no. Oh, oh but I think I might have bruised my paw. Oh, oh, oh! Oh, 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 yeah, oh, yeah. I definitely hurt my paw. I should go get Emily Elizabeth. Or Mrs. Diller. Or Dr. Dan. 
Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> I'm okay, really. I just need to rest my paw. Let's fix a place where Cleo can sit and rest for a while. There! How's that? A snow couch? Cool! It's perfect. Thanks, Clifford. You're welcome. Oh, hey, you want me to show you my latest ice skating routine? Sure. Okay, here goes. Go, Mac! Go for it! Great, Mac! Emily Elizabeth, I guess it's time to go home, huh? Can I give you a ride, Cleo? Sure. Coming back? No thanks. I think I'll stay here and practice my triple flipple. Okay, see you, see Mac. You, Mac. Bye. There you go, Cleo. Thanks, Clifford. Uh, Cleo? Wasn't it your other paw that you hurt? <gasps> oh no! It's spreading. Uh, both of my paws are bruised now. I better go lie down. Uh, bye. Gosh, I hope she's going to be okay, Clifford. I hope so too, T-Bone. <laughs> I had a really fun day today, Clifford. Charlie brought these saucer sleds to the park, and I'd never ridden a sled like that before. I was afraid I was going to be really bad at it and get totally embarrassed. I didn't even want to try it at first. Yeah! But the more times I slid, the better I got. Now I can't wait to go sledding again tomorrow. Yeah! Woo. See you later, Clifford. Wow! Emily Elizabeth was afraid to go on that new sled today. I wonder if Cleo was afraid to go out on the ice. Maybe that's why she said her paw hurt. Hey, Cleo. Uh-oh. You feeling better today? We're going back to the ice rink. Oh, great. Oh, oh. Going back to the ice rink, huh? We were going to, but if your paw still hurts. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's still pretty sore. Wasn't it your front paw you hurt? Huh? Oh, yeah. <gasps> it must be spreading. Oh, that's too bad. But don't you worry about me. I'm just fine with going back to the ice rink. I love watching you guys. Come on, follow me. It's really weird how her sore paw keeps moving around, huh? Yeah, it is. Come and try my slippy twirly spin thing, Mac. It's fun. Woohoo! Oh, woohoo! That does look fun. Let me try. Whoa! Come on, Mac. Try it. I don't know how to do that. I look ridiculous. Ah, uh, don't worry. No one does it perfect the first time. Well, okay. I'll try. I think Mac was kind of afraid to try. But look at him now. He sure is having fun. <laughs> huh. Yeah! Whoa, 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 whoa. It does look kind of fun. I want to try it. Oops. Uh, maybe your paw is better, Cleo. Why don't you try it and see? Great idea, Clifford. Hey, would you look at that? <laughs> it is better. <laughs> How about that? 
Well, come on, then. Let's get on the ice. Woohoo! Okay. Here goes. Whoa, <laughs> this is really great. What about your sore paw? Yeah. Guys, I have to tell you the truth. I didn't really hurt my paw. Huh? Then why'd you tell us you did, Cleo? I guess I was kind of afraid. <laughs> you were afraid? Of what? Well, I've never skated before. I guess I was afraid I was going to be really bad at it. And you guys would laugh at how silly I looked. We all look pretty silly, Cleo. But trying new things with your friends is fun. You're right. What was I thinking? So let's all have fun and do my slippy, twirly, spinny thingy together. <laughs> okay, let's do it. Yeah! How about a little help, big guy? Okay. Yeah! <laughs> Thanks, Clifford. You're welcome, Cleo. they didn't have. Then, Speckle got an idea. He picked up a paper tube and blew into it like a trumpet. Reba took a glass of water and a spoon and created a tinkling chime. Darnell and Luna used pots and lids as drums and cymbals. But Rabbi didn't know what to do. Speckle said there was still one thing their band needed, someone to lead them. They all soon discovered that the very best part of being a band was making music together. The end. That was a great story. Isn't reading fun? <laughs> Nice to see you, too. I've been busy getting ready for Keep Birdwell Island Beautiful Day. Whoop, whoop. See you later, Clifford. ready for the big celebration tomorrow. So I need volunteers to clean up around the bandstand in Birdwell Park. The bandstand is where the big Keep Birdwell Island Beautiful ceremony will take place. So everyone is going to see it? I guess you're right. Everyone will see it. I'll do it, Miss Carrington. <laughs> Why, thank you, Jetta. And who would like to help? Oh, that's OK, Miss Carrington. I can do it myself. Huh? 
Are you sure, Jetta? It's an awfully big job. Oh, it's no problem for me. I'm sure I can do an amazing job. <laughs> Jetta always wants to be the star. Well, I suppose you could try, but... Thank you, Miss Carrington. I'll start right away. <laughs> okay. And finally, I'll need some volunteers for the pier. Okay, Charlie and Emily Elizabeth. <laughs> and Clifford, of course. Here comes Clifford! Hiya, Clifford! Hey, Clifford! Come to help us, boy? You better go get it, boy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Clifford, but we're almost done here. Why don't you go see if someone else could use your help? Woof. Tomorrow everyone will see the great job that I've done. Then they all will agree that I am number one. <laughs> Clifford. Whoa, whoa. Um, you know, I'm really trying to clean up here, so could you just sit quietly over there? Don't worry, Clifford, I'll be done soon. There's a lot more work to do here than I thought there'd be. This place looks really great. Yeah, I can't wait until the party tomorrow. I wonder how Jetta's doing, trying to take care of the whole big bandstand area all by herself? Let's go! Oh, I gotta finish this sign. Pick up the leaves and, and then wash the chairs and then decorate and well, at least the banner's done. Everyone's gonna love it. Huh? Oh no! I'm stuck! I can't get my foot out. Uh-oh, Jetta needs help! Take a bath. Can we help you clean up here? No, I can do it myself. Hmm. She's never gonna finish this by tomorrow all by herself? Well, you offered to help Emily Elizabeth and she said no. Poor Jetta. I wonder if there's something I can do to help. Hi, Charlie. Hey, Emily. Watch this. Oops. <laughs> Good 
good one, Charlie. Have you seen Clifford? No, but I'll help you look for him. Great, let's go. Look, Emily Elizabeth, there's Clifford. Hmm. Clifford, are you trying to help Jetta? Oh, that's really nice of you. I'll help too. Woof. What are you doing, Emily? Clifford has the right idea. We're going to help Jenna finish in time. Why? Because she really needs our help, Charlie. I think it's just hard for Jetta to admit it. So, you want to help us? I don't know. Come on, Charlie. We can be like secret elves and surprise Jetta. <laughs> I think Clifford wants me to help. <laughs> okay, Clifford. It might be kind of fun. Great! Whoa. surprised. Hey, let's hide and wait for her to come back. Oh, great idea. I can't wait to see the look on her face. Oh, I'm never going to finish the park in time. about the nicest thing anyone has ever done for me. Thank you, Clifford. You were right, Emily Elizabeth. It feels pretty good helping a friend out. It sure does. Emily Elizabeth? Charlie? Uh-oh, she sees us. Did you and Clifford finish the job for me? Well, um... I told you guys I didn't want any help. But I'm sure glad you didn't listen to me. Huh? huh? Thank you, guys. I never would have finished without your help. Well, friends are supposed to help each other. Emily Elizabeth, you and Charlie are the best. Whoa. <laughs> and Clifford, too. <laughs> Can't get me. Ha! Clifford's it. Okay, I'm it. But first, let's eat. Clifford and I both love playing with our friends. It's fun to be together, especially when you share. Having a picnic today was a great idea, Clifford. Yeah, I brought a whole bag of my favorite dog treats. They're so good. Who wants to try one? I do. You bet. Me too. Mine are delicious too. Here. Great, looks good. Yeah, you guys have to taste mine. Thanks. Mine are pretty doggone good, too. 
Aren't you gonna share, Mac? Oh, <laughs> yeah. Sorry. Uh, try one of mine, guys. Mmm, thanks. Okay. You're right, Mac. <laughs> Yum. It's nice when you share with your friends. That's why Clifford's big idea for today is sharing. <laughs>